Well, Free National Movement Chairman Carl Kummer Sr. describing his friend and brother Tennyson Wells as a man who didn't like to lose and offered himself to his party and country in a number of ways. Kummer telling ZNS News this afternoon that he last spoke to his friend in hospital last Thursday and he expected that he would be discharged soon. However, he says the news he received this morning was a shock. The Bahamas has truly lost a, a strong individual. He has um, done many things and many ministries. He has uh, helped many persons. Um, he has been a um, business, businessman to many other um, persons that, that have, have worked with him. Uh, so he's one of those persons that, you know, you can never forget. Um, I've known him, like I said, from 1979. Uh, he won in, in 87, continued uh, in politics. And he was a strong FNM. He Even when the FNM needed um, finances or needed assistance, he was one of those persons, whether, whether given advice. Uh, he was on a number of um, um, backroom committees that we sat on. And Mr. Wells um, was one of those persons who was, uh, and still was at his death, one of the advisors to the, the PM. Mr. Calmer says in the coming days, plans will be announced for a memorial service. He says he, the loss is personal for him as he further reflected on the time he's known Mr. Wells. Um, Mr. Wells was uh, a giant of a man. Uh, he always wanted to win and he was out there. He was an exceptional uh, campaigner as well as an exceptional uh, MP and minister. Um, as you know, Mr. Wells was known and his constituency as one of those persons who took representation to another level. And uh, in Bamboo Town in 1982, he lost, but in 1987, he was able to win that seat in Bamboo Town. And I've been close to Mr. Wells um, ever since.